Hop, 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 little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. We are packing up this table. It looks havoc because there's lots of food in the fridge that I need to sort out now. But good morning. It is April 1st. My uncle's already sent me a photo today and I fell for it of a broken ankle saying, oh no. And my nan rung me like, who's broke their foot? And we're just like, like literally don't know. It could be any of the boys. But we've realized that we fell for it. It's April Fool's. Anyways. This time last year was my due date, and here we are a year later, getting ready to go and have Ocean's first birthday party, which is crazy and fun. But this is how my fridge is looking at the minute. I don't think it's ever been so full, but it actually doesn't look too bad, but it's very full. This is gonna be a graze for around 50 to 60 people. So Kelsey has put this all in my fridge because i live the closest to the venue and i've got to bag it all up now because she's gonna come pick it up and then start doing the grays and why are we eating these look what she's eating good morning everyone this is what we're eating this morning you help mommy pack the bags yeah <laughs> down for a nap just on my makeup with her on my lap the whole time it was a carnage i cannot believe it's actually turned out okay <laughs> and the girls need basil it was in the fridge i didn't realize so i'm going to the venue i'm gonna take some bits that i had to take oh no there's makeup on this already i can hear her moaning anyway she needs to nap i push her nap back a bit so she's ratty but we've literally planned a whole party bag in the middle of her second nap of the day but there's just no way around it because she's not awake long enough for it to work out unless we literally had a party at like 11 a.m but it's such a big ask when people are traveling to be that early i mean we're literally having a party at 12 but anyways just to update you off to drop basil and we'll see how the venue's looking before and then hopefully I mean, we're not doing drastic changes, but we can do a little bit of a before and after, before the balloons is out and everything. So, here's the venue. I've got my staff in. Hello, we've got Tyra from K&T Grazes. <laughs> the grazing board is commencing. I'm not even going to ask what they're up to because it's all pretty intricate stuff. As you can see, we've got some flowers over here. We've got some orange extravaganzas. Yeah. Okay. No. So, this is where people can get like milkshakes, hot drinks, stuff like that. And then we are setting up. So I don't think, I can't remember what I've said, but we've got this as like the food area and then for adults and stuff. And then you can't really see because it's tinted. I'll go downstairs in a sec, but there's Jodie. If you know Jodie, that is my uncle Lee's partner. Oh, you can't see. But we've got the gymnastics. What would it be called? Stadium. <laughs> Room? Yeah. Room. <laughs> and then we've got Megan doing balloons as always. Oh my God, it's already looking so good. <laughs> and she's got a baby growing herself so soon you'll be doing your own yeah. birthday parties and stuff but anyway guys good work keep it up just pulled up to the house don't feel like it now i'ma just lay back and crack this window to love and leave everyone they're all doing a fantastic job and this is the last you're gonna see of everything god it's all a bit chaotic but i've got to go and get the birthday girl ready now so i'll oh, see you all soon just finishing up the greys the party's actually been going on for about half an hour but to be honest everyone's downstairs i will go down i couldn't find my camera again this bloody window but you can see down there it's quite busy but just wanted to quickly give you a pan before it gets 
completely carnage up here when everyone comes up for some food. We got a little oshi. That looks so good, guys. Thank you. You're welcome. You done nothing. <laughs> <laughs> and then here's the cake. Oh my god, I forgot to show you the cake. Look at that. So the little sign at the front says ocean. Oh yeah, I've not even looked at the bottles. One second. Well, the biscuits look so cute. Yeah, good. So good. Job, yeah, let's see the bottles. Oh my God, so cute. Oh! <laughs> it's literally ocean overload. We've got all this bunting. All her milestones. Yeah. Very good. Thank you, everyone. Great effort. Again, you probably can't see for it. Oh, you can. That's my big cousin. Well, he's not big, but as in, like, he's younger than me. But oh, we've had the best day. I can't believe how quick kids' parties go. And luckily, obviously, a lot of my friends are also YouTubers, so they took my camera for me and started vlogging, which I really appreciate. So, thank you, girls, if you picked up the camera today. And thank you so much to anyone that comes to the party. It's something that you plan for months and months, and it's over like that. It's crazy. Ocean's had the best time as well. I thought she would have crashed by now. She's Strong, to be honest. And now it's goodbye until the next one. I feel like I'm gonna be so confused. I'm kind of going between two videos at the minute. I'm doing a vlog currently, right now, like of this week, and I'm about to now do a bit for the party vlog that you're watching right now. But it's been a few days since Ocean's party, and first, I just want to say. A, it was amazing. It turns out way better than we had ever imagined it could. It's such a great idea if you're wondering what you should do for a first birthday or even older. I was a bit like, is, is a gymnastics party a little bit too old for her? But it was pretty much just like a giant soft play. Careful. So many people that came said it was such a good idea and it's something you probably wouldn't consider doing for a one-year-old. So recommend that. And also, if you came along, 
thank you so much we appreciate it more than you can imagine so many people made the effort to travel really far literally my friends are dotted all over the country and so many of you got her beautiful gifts which i don't know if they're beautiful yet i assume they are but we've not opened them so that is what this part is going to be the reason i'm doing this is obviously to show how grateful we are and also i've really struggled to come up with things for a one-year-old i feel like i'm kind of getting the gist of things but it's intriguing to see how the people that have obviously as we go through i'll say if they've got other kids but some of these people have like three-year-olds and they obviously will know better than me what one-year-olds like so i thought i'd do a little unboxing the light's probably going to change because i'm sitting next to the door and it's really bright daylight which is good but it keeps changing it was just raining now it's beautiful sunshine so ocean shall we open some presents you want some? She started doing this new face. I'll see if she does it on camera. She probably will because she does it like every five minutes. Can you come here? Do you open some presents? She goes like this. I don't know who saw her. She's like, you're laughing at me. I can hear my phone ringing. Who's ringing me? It's Daddy. Quick, Daddy's ringing. Quick, quick, Daddy's ringing. Look. I It's Daddy. Say hi, Dada. <laughs> <laughs> it's your dada. Oh my god, more birthday presents. Daddy's got my birthday presents for you. <gasps> What's that? It's a ship plan. What is that? Is that a dark? Also, yes, we've still got Cassis balloons up. Shall we open some presents? <gasps> You've been dying to do this, haven't you? Also, I might do this over a couple days. You're going to be like, you're so dramatic. But she obviously has the attention span of a baby <laughs> so maybe we'll do a, we'll see how we go but as soon as she starts to show that she's getting a little bit bored i'll probably leave a few till tomorrow obviously her birthday's not actually till next week so ah no there's three cards in this bag there's three cards in this bag oh no how are we gonna know who it's from um, right, let's start with the cards. That's so boring for you, but then I can kind of whittle down who this is from. Oh. So, this is from, look, Pia drew you a picture. <gasps> She's drawing you a picture. Happy first birthday, beautiful girl. Love from Zelia, Ben, Pia and Nyla. Ah, oh, so this could be from them, but it might not be. Should we get it out to you? <gasps> wow, look at that. Cute little dress. from them because I know they'll love Sainsbury's clothes but I will double check let me quickly open the other cards so obviously clothes is a given it's in my opinion it's one of the best ideas okay I know that's not from them because I was given that card before her party okay perfect so it's down to these two and this has money in it <gasps> you're so lucky you're so lucky look Bobby, I'm getting confused. You can't do that. <laughs> You've got to wait. Which bag? I'm going to sort she's stuck. I don't know which bag. She just got that out of. Wow, some of our friends, Hannah and Sunny, got us. Well, got you some money. So we can buy you some new clothes and new toys. That's a good idea as well. So, the clothes are from Zelia and Ben. Thank you so much. Wow. So this is, we made a spider for you, Ocean. Love from Birdie and Goldie. <gasps> Birdie and Goldie made that for you. What else is in here? Should we open it? Ocean, do it. Ocean, do it. Ocean, do it. Ocean, rip it. Some chocolate. Ocean, rip it. Look. Oh, Merlin Class Kids. Who knew Merlin Class had a kids collection? That is cute. Look at that little beach dress. Imagine you're on holiday in that. That is so cute. It's literally like this. Bless you, baby the swing kind of cut of a adult dress that is so cute thank you so much cc clothes is a good one isn't it mommy loves it when people get you clothes should we do this one okay this is from my cousins this is from amy this is from amy and jen ready ocean do it ocean do it break that it's so confusing for them because she reads her books and 
gives off vibes that she wants to rip the pages. And I'm like, no, I don't rip the pages. But then I'm like, rip this paper. <gasps> Some books for Ocean. <gasps> books is such a good one in my opinion. Should we do one more? Should we try this one? Wow. It says your name on it. Ocean fun bath time. Boys for the bathy. Wow. Bath toys, I feel like you can't go wrong with. I've actually bought a couple of bath toys for her. But this is cute, obviously, because coincidentally it's got her name on it. That's from the Berry Girls. That's from our friends. Thank you so much, Mel, Dina, and Fleur. And of course, Russell. <gasps> That's so be waving to it, that one. We can put that in your bathy tonight if you want. Should we put that in your bath tonight? Okay, she kind of seems in the mood to do it another one i know this one's from georgia so georgia actually got mummy something as well look georgia got mummy some flowers i should have got them out a little bit earlier probably they're beautiful thank you g card no oh, it's a peter rabbit card wow oh i love from auntie g and uncle leon you love your auntie and uncle don't you what's in here <gasps> ocean Look what's in there. Look what's in there. <gasps> what is that? It's a duck. <gasps> wow, it's a duck. Give duck kisses. Oh, and a cute little Peter Rabbit themed dress. She's so cute. Thank you so much, guys. We love you. Should we stop there for now? She's yawning away. So we'll come back for the next part when we open some more presents. Part two of opening Ocean's presents from her party. We look a bit windswept because we've been to a little picnic thing today and it was so windy. And also, yes, that is Dada sleeping in the background. So should we open your presents, Bobby? We've only got about six to go, so let's see. You don't want it? <gasps> wow. So this one I think is from Josh, Abby, and Bump. That's going to be your new bub with cousin. <gasps> so we do actually already have this, but that's okay. We will see if we can swap that out. But these are so good, like piano mats. So Josh and Abby are my cousins, so they're having a baby. And we're saying it's going to be Ocean's cousin, but technically it's going to be her second cousin, I guess. <gasps> what is this, Ocean? Look. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this looks so good. This is called Our Little World. It's like a little busy board, but it's a nice one that you can have probably put on the wall. So basically, for people that don't know what a busy board is, it's just loads of things that babies can just play with each section that is such a nice one with the pastel colors <laughs> it's so cute look at that oh you like it you like that one that's a good reaction wow she really likes that in case anyone wants to know that is a cool one isn't it <gasps> as much as i want you to play with it i do want to get through these presents bobby you want to play with it don't you actually if it's really nice with our little dutch things that we have which you can kind of see out the corner here which is the theme of um pale light pastel woods this one is from rara so i'm sure you all know who harley and Alora are that time that i first met up with them is so annoying it's i think i mentioned it in a vlog but if you don't know who they are they are tiktok stars in my eyes oh look look it says ocean so we met up with them and I vlogged it and that's the day after I got my bag stolen and my camera was in there so I lost all the vlog but they are friends that we've made now and they're just the cutest little family. Oh my goodness, look at this. It's your own backpack. We can use it for holiday. Oh, should we put it on? It's your own backpack. I think it's got something in it. Oh my goodness. It says promotion in the ocean. <laughs> That's your name. And that is the cutest bag. It's like a wipe down one. We've got a couple of fabric ones. 
But this one is good because if you spill stuff, I'm actually going to use that when we're on holiday. Look, should we put it on your back? I don't think she'll have it, but we'll see. Wow! Standing up. Oh, <laughs> you got your back back on. Thank you, guys. Right, who we got next? No <laughs> laughing at. I know this one's from Imogen and Renelia and Oriavella. So she actually told me, and I should have ripped this open the other day, that she sent Spencer, her husband, out to get back in the And she said, get ocean themed if you can. And he took that as get a blue themed. And if you look close, it's actually dinosaurs. And that makes sense. But ocean look. Ooh. What is this? Wow. It's an ice cream counter. So this is what they got us. Imogen actually sent me a picture of this and said, does she already have this? Because the girls have it and they love it. But no, she doesn't have it and it does look really fun. We're not going to open this today because you've already got so many little things you're throwing around today that we've opened. But thank you so much, guys. Okay, next. Yeah. Let's try and fly through these now. We've got Sheena, James, Tamika, and the boys. Yeah. So this is Cass's older sister. <gasps> Look! Ocean! Oh, see, she's bored now. We get to this point and she's just bored. Ocean, look! Ocean! Ocean! Look, it's a book. It says Goodnight Lion. Okay, I don't want anyone to think that I'm being ungrateful right now. I'm going to fly through these and then I'm going to kind of put them in a pile so she can actually take them in all week. Oh my God, so cute. I love it when everyone makes it to the theme. This is from Connor, Liv, Noah, Fia and Romy. And I know that this is with that as well. She sent me something in the post as well. Strawberries, it matches what you're wearing now, Mama. Look. Look. Strawberries. <gasps> so cute. And then we've got something else in here. Strawberry shoes. They are so cute. As you can tell, we've got a strawberry theme, haven't we? Wow. That can go with your ice cream kit. Cake stacking game. Oh my god, that's so cute. I love that. Again, it's matching the wooden pastel aesthetic. Oh, and some hair clips. Thank you so much. Love you guys. Next up, we have this is from Aisha Jack, Mila, and Maya. Oh, where's that? It's a llama. Is it called a llama or a llama? Llama? Wow. And then you've got some more books in here. Look. More books. She loves books like that. Ones where you can flap bits down. So we've got this book and this book. Thank you so much, guys. Leah and Delilah. Oh my goodness, you're gonna love this. Look, 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 look. More interested in the paper. What is that ocean? What is this? Your Barbie car! It's a Barbie car! Wow, that is amazing! I'm even excited by this. See, we were looking at stuff like this in Smith Toys. I can tell she's going to absolutely love that. Thank you so much, Leah. I love that. That's one of my friends. But this is why we actually haven't bought her loads. We've got her a few bits, but... I just knew, literally looked at this. I think I looked at one bigger. I knew that she would get similar bits. That's why it's quite tricky when it comes to, like you're obviously restricted with one year old and what they can have. Next up, oh my goodness. Ocean, look in this bag. This is from <gasps> Auntie Teresa. <gasps> it's your favorite. It's an octopus. Oh, it's an octopus. You guys know the obsession that she has with octopuses. I can put my hand, oh my goodness. <gasps> it's a reversible, <laughs> it's reversible, look. Where's he gone? <laughs> She's gonna love that, that is so cute. I have no idea where that's from. Thank you so much, Trey. we love you. Right, we have one more, if you are still here, then honestly, hope that you either find this interesting like i say again no way to brag i found this 
really hard in the beginning to find what to get a one year old. It's really hard. I feel like you do have to kind of push above the age. Like for example, Liv's got us since 18 months plus, but we're obviously still gonna let her play a bit. Uh, this one's from Alice. Wow, oh no! Again, this is on the list of things we were gonna get. This is, I've seen people with these. I think I've seen Lucy Finnegan, which by the way, this is just remind me. So Lucy actually couldn't make the party with Ziggy. They didn't feel well when they woke up. But what she's wearing right now, the little strawberry set, she sent in the post and is from them for her birthday. Um, but yeah, I've seen Lucy use these with Ziggy. They're so cool. You put the card in the machine and it tells you, like it says what it is. So it obviously encourages them to start talking about this is such a good one so thank you so much alice and then this is the little track so it's really grubby because we've been out today but this is from zara and that i'm pretty sure is everything i think if i've missed you out i'm so sorry but the mess around us right now is crazy <sighs> honestly i feel silly even getting her too much for her actual birthday on wednesday i hope that doesn't come across wrong but there's only so much a baby can have and i don't want her to i don't know just not be grateful obviously she's not it's so hard because she's one you get what i'm saying i don't want her to think that it's normal to get this much because she's so so lucky and we've got the best family and friends but thank you so much for watching say bye <laughs> good girl do kisses kisses <laughs> No, not your toys. Kisses to the camera. You say we love you. Thank you for watching. And thank you for my presents. <laughs>